Each year, 6.5 million dogs and cats arrive at animal shelters. But because there's not enough room or resources at those shelters, over a million dogs and cats never find their way out and are euthanized. Pet Connect Rescue, founded in 2005 by Lizette Chanick, has grown from a few friends working to save pets in the aftermath of Hurricane Katrina to over 200 volunteers who are dedicated to helping abandoned cats and dogs day in and day out. Pet Connect Rescue will pull animals from high kill shelters. Pulling means that we'll speak for them, say we will take them, we will be responsible for their adoption. Pet Connect Rescue volunteers transport animals from overcrowded shelters locally and from other states. We arrange and pay for medical services ranging from routine treatments, such as vaccinations and blood tests, to treating serious medical conditions. All the animals, when old enough, are spayed or neutered to help decrease the terrible problem of pet overpopulation. We then place them into foster homes or at one of our two rescue centers where they receive loving care and socialization. We get to know each animal's personality and what he or she needs in a forever family. Most importantly, our animals never see a shelter again. Pet Connect Rescue animals are listed online on websites and on social media. We spend a lot of time in the community getting the word out about our animals with fun events like Yappy Hours, Strut Your Mutt, and March Muttness. And we hold many cat and dog adoption events so families can meet the animals looking for their forever homes. I think Pet Connect Rescue is a very special organization and perhaps our greatest quality is that we really care about the adopter and about the animal. We try very hard to make a good match. We're not trying to just turn our animals over as quickly as possible to get them home. We take the time and the care to get to know the animal first, and we support the adoption process really every step of the way from being extremely upfront about what we know about the dog or cat and then helping with resource, resources uh, with trainers or just following up. How are you doing with your new kitten? How are you doing with Benji the dog? You know, and what can we do to help you? Pet Connect Rescue also maintains Muddy Paul's Farm in Mount Airy, Maryland. Muddy Paul's Farm is a beautiful five-acre licensed transitional residence for dogs. It provides a place where these rescues can safely explore their newfound freedom and where they can meet potential adopters. For some of our dogs, this is the first time they've ever had the chance to run and play. We offer a special program just for senior dogs as well. We make sure they are placed either in senior-focused foster homes or at our warm and welcoming Haydorn Canine Cottage in Upper Marlboro, Maryland. These senior dogs will remain in our loving care for however long it may take to find them their new families. That's the demographic that really touches my heart, and breaks my heart, because sometimes people are older and they didn't provide for their animal and they can no longer care for that animal or they've passed away. And that once beloved dog or cat is now in a shelter, confused, really terrified, because um, they've known a home their whole lives and people don't want to adopt the older animals, or, or fewer people want to adopt the older animals, I should say, and yet they offer so much. Volunteer, foster, adopt, donate. Together we can save these animals, reduce pet overpopulation, and find loving forever homes for more cats and dogs. Our animals thank you.